What's going on people? It's Greg here with another Excel VBA tutorial video. Today we'll be going over how to send an email from a specific account. So let's get right into it. Let's say you have um, two email addresses. You can have two or more. And you've got your personal email address and then you have like a team email account that you share. And you want to be able to specify from which email address you're going to be sending your message to when you create your macro. So we'll start with our sub and we'll call it send from another and it's going to allow you to send from another email address send from a different email address um, we'll declare our variables we've got out app as an object then we got out mail as an object and then we'll have our string body we'll call it str body as our string so we'll set out app equal to create object and then outlook application and then we'll set out mail equal to out app dot create item the zero all right so for our string body we will first start off with our body type or our body style and let's just go with the basic 12 font and then our font family we'll just go with Arial continue on to the next line so I'll use an ampersand and an underscore to keep it going and our message is going to say hello We'll just do something really basic and we'll say have a great day. Continue the line, ampersand, underscore, and then I'll say, oh, by the way, these uh, these P's are like uh, paragraph spacing, so it'll skip two lines down. So after this hello comma, it'll, there'll be two spaces or two, two lines down is where have a great day will start and then two lines down again is where I'm gonna put best regards and then I'll do a single line break with a BR and then have my name best regards Greg alright so that's my message body so for the actual sending of the email we'll do on error resumes resume next and without mail The key here is to do sent on behalf of name. So this allows you to determine which email address you're sending from. So I could be specific and just type in personal at um, email.com. Or I could uh, choose the cell. So let me just create a quick drop down here. So I'll do. Uh, I'll choose a cell data and then data validation create a list and my source will just be these two cells here so now I've got a drop down and what I'll do is I'll reference whatever cell this cell here I reference whatever's in this cell so we'll just do sheets and the sheet name is actually sheet one but we can change it to whatever we want just reference it and then the cell it's going to be down one over two so this cell here so down one over two and we want the text from that cell I'm going to send it to a random email address, so abc at 123.com. And then I'll cc no one, bcc no one. And then my subject will just be um, daily message. And then I'll add the data in there too. So I'll just do format 
date and this will just give me whatever today's date is my format will be month day and year and then I'll display the message if I were to put sent here the message will go straight out but I'm gonna hit display so we can see it first and then you want to do HTML body equals str body so it equals this up here and then HTML body all right so I can end my width here Jeez. all right and then on error go to zero and then I'll set out mail equal to nothing and I'll set out app equal to nothing all right so that should do it so let's go ahead and run this so out the drop down I'll just choose personal email for the first one so let it run and you see it's from my personal at email.com and it's going to abc123.com daily message is November 18th 2020 hello have a great day best regards Greg all right so you see it's from personal at email.com right so I'll change this to team run it boom now it's from team at email.com that's simple this is the key right here that's all you gotta do sent on behalf of name and that's all I have for today thank you so much for watching make sure to like comment subscribe have a good one